Hey y'all, welcome to my channel. If you guys are new, my name is Cass. I talk all about DIY budget friendly content creation to enhance your brand business or just create better content in general, you guys. And today we're creating a magazine cover on our iPhone. Boom, boom. I feel like it's been a while since we've done like an iPhone photo shoot, photo shoot, photo shoot. One day I'll be able to say that word. I feel like it's been a while since we did an iPhone photo shoot. Um, so I really wanted to bring it back, do one in the studio. And for this one, since the last video we did album covers, that would be fun to play around with the concept of magazine covers. So for this shoot first, you guys, I attempted using my fish eye lens on my iphone so i put my fish eye lens on my iphone um in order to shoot for my iphone i did connect it to my computer using quicktime if you guys have an apple computer you can just use your standard um charging cable plug it into your computer and then um plug your phone into the cable you can open quicktime go to file new movie recording click the little down arrow and select your device whatever your device name is and then it'll actually show you your phone screen on your computer so i did that so that i could shoot with my front facing camera but still see what the heck was going on um so for the first part of the shoot you guys I actually put on the fish eye lens on my phone and i laid it on the ground i wanted to kind of get this weird angle thing going on um i put my lights on kind of like a blood orange and like a red light um fill for that and i thought about putting my sheet over it did that for one didn't feel the need to do it for anymore um, but I shot some shots like that I kind of played around with holding that um, phone in my hand and then I switched over to green light for a little bit giving up <laughs> no <laughs> after that i decided to put up my white sheet and on the white sheet i just shot some stuff like on my seat i got down on the ground tried some different things you guys um but yes yeah, so that's that was that's the bones we had to work with i just used my regular iphone camera for that baby i used my hue bulbs inside of my softbox lights for the first shoot like i mentioned i did the two hue bulbs orange two hue bulbs red and then when i got the white backdrop i just turned the hue bulbs on the standard bright setting <laughs>
In editing you guys, first I brought my photos into Lightroom, the mobile app. So um, a lot of the features you guys see me do in my how to edit photos video is all in the Lightroom app, you guys. So I went into the Lightroom app, played around with the exposure, the shadows, the um, whites to bright up the, brighten up the whites a little bit. I took away some of the texture and the clarity as well as I <laughs> added like a white um, vignette to the photos that had the white backdrop. You guys can play around with the black vignette on some of the photos as well, especially those ones with like the color kind of fisheye fill. And that's pretty much all I did in Lightroom. Then I bring it into Visco so I can get my beloved color um, filter that I love. And then I bring that Visco into Prequel where they already have some pre-made magazine covers that you guys can add, you can modify, tweak to fit however you would like your photo to look but that is how you guys can shoot your own magazine cover um using your phone editing 100 percent on your phone and get some really cool results so i hope that you guys enjoyed this video definitely subscribe comment below if you want to see more give me a thumbs up your girls out